There's a scam that's going on against small business owners and you have to be mindful of things like this because I get them all the time and it's easy for me to see the difference. But someone who's new or maybe might not know, they could be get taken for. So without further ado, I received this uh, email from a uh, Brian Collins, an IP attorney. And they told me that I have to send them attorney fees of $200 and a government fee of a $350. So you're looking at what, $550, $600. I'm sure they'll add up some other things, but I mean, it all looks legit. I took my uh, my company name out here, but uh, it just pretty much says, hey, this company is trying to uh, essentially have your own IP. They're, they're registering federally. You're only registered in the state. And uh, if you don't, if you want to be compliant, then you're going to send us money or they're just going to take your business. And that's not how things work. So uh, that, these people are dumb, but I want to show, go over some of the things I would be mindful of. So, I mean, their website looks legit. I mean, it looks like a your basic website. I mean, very, very standard. As you can see, this one has all sorts of uh, trademark services, trademark monitoring, and it's just a way to steal money from you. And they won't do anything for you. It's a completely fake site. If we go to and check out their web performance, lawofficesnj.us, you can see that is a completely new website. Uh, no engagement, nothing, no traffic, no bouncing, no nothing. So, if it's a real law office, they're going to have more than just, uh, you know, a month's worth of traffic or anything. They're going to have a, some kind of trail and they don't. If we uh, check their website and type in site, we can see probably nothing's even uh, indexed on the Google machine. So we definitely know it's just a built site that is uh, meant to steal your money. And so as you can see, I'm using a... Uh, short code or a, I don't know what they're called, but it's to see if they are actually indexed on the Google machine and they're not. So this is definitely a scam. Be careful. <coughs> what I did was I actually called them from another number and the guy said his name was Larry and he talked like, a, I don't know, like a, he changed his voice like he like pitched it differently and I knew that he couldn't keep up with his scam because this is Brian and who's Larry. And uh, I'm just thinking that I should warn everyone that is a small business owner because, uh, you know, no one likes to get taken advantage of. And if I'm able to uh, warn people about a scam like this then uh, and save one per pe person, then it was all worth it. So fuck those guys and fuck scammers. That's it. Peace.